I'm thinking in my gut brain on my right side that they give these people <laughs> look at the other white truck white truck and he got on a red shirt too he so perked out um they get a ass a little memo little memo they tell him probably don't want to fuck with her just just fuck with her i don't really want to fuck with her because Motherfucker get sick and tired of being sick and tired. And, and actually, oh, I never thought about that. Okay, so most of my fucking, most of my perps are either young and restless, uh, young and reckless motherfuckers or older people. Typically older people. And you know what? You know what I didn't figure out? It just came to me this second. They know, like, I don't really pose a threat. Like, like how, I, uh, how I'm acting right now. Like, I genuinely will crack the fuck up and go on about my business. I'm going to let you know that I know. You know, I might say some smart shit. But I don't really feel the need to go out my way to get arrested for some dumb shit. I don't feel that need. Not in my life. It ain't even that serious. Because for you, you don't even... Fuck how I feel about myself. You don't respect yourself enough to go take the word of some motherfucking body else to go out your way to fuck with another motherfucker. But you don't know this motherfucker from a can of paint at Menards. Motherfucker might haul off and slap shit dog fire from your ass. But you're going to take that chance. So you don't, you don't give a damn about your life any motherfucking way. Clearly. So what, why in the fuck would I jeopardize what I got going on, bitch? I wouldn't give a fuck if it was nothing at all. I ain't finna go to jail and be sitting in no motherfucking cell by a, a goofy motherfucker. You a goofy motherfucker. But, so they send old people like this, old lady right here, but her car is green. But they send old people because old people, they, they don't really, they not here for the problems. They just want to, um you know, find out a couple few things. They want to watch you be able to have something to report, have something to talk to um, their neighbors about over tea, you know, or some shit like that. Look at her. I see you. I see you. Oh, that's. She pulled up, parked right there, then backed up, parked over here. That kind of shit right there really, like, it's just irritating. That's it. It's not. It's nothing more than that. You just a little bit of irritation, and then some days I really don't even be giving a fuck. I don't give a damn what they do. <laughs> but when they go out their way to be like crazy, like retarded, do dumb shit. Like you're ninety. Why are you outside and doing circles and shit, playing these motherfucking games? Why? Don't you want to be at Bingo Hall, some motherfucking work, at the Senior Citizen Citizen Center down there? Or something? Something. I don't know. Look, she, she all behind me right here. Lady, Walmart is up there a long ways, and she's about 75. Look at this old bitch. Look at this old bitch. Where? Where do you want to park, lady? Can you see her? Where? Where do you want to park? Is she so bold? See, then now that's a that's an old miserable ass bitch right there. That's what she is, an old miserable bitch. She she want a motherfucker to um see her motherfucking ass like she she wanted to be a problem and that's this is another thing though these texas old people is a little bit different <laughs> these texas old people feel like they know something and don't know nothing <laughs> don't know shit look at this three white cars in the road stop right there yeah you supposed to stop right there right there 
Right there. Stop right there. <laughs> oh, and she got a flat tire. That's what you get for being a fucking gang stalker. Flat tire. How about that, bitch? <laughs>